Hi friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn about consolidating data from multiple worksheets in Excel. A worksheet in Excel is a single page within a workbook consisting of rows and columns for entering and organizing data. Here we have railway department wise failure data for the first quarter which is from January to March spread across different worksheet for different quarters. The task is to consolidate this data onto a single sheet. This means combining the data from all worksheets into one, accepting for automatic updating if changes occur in the source data. To do this, we will use the consolidate option in Microsoft Excel. First navigate to the data tab and click on consolidate in the data tools group. In the consolidate window choose the appropriate function for consolidation such as sum. Since we want to add data from different worksheets then select the range of data from the worksheet using the reference box and the add button. Click on this arrow then go to Q1 sheet and select this data range with headings. Now click on add button. Repeat process and add data here from all sheets. Ensure that the checkboxes for the top row and left column are checked. If your data includes header and left column labels that you want to include in the output. If you want to maintain links to the source data in the output, check the create links to source data checkbox. After configuring these settings, Click OK to consolidate the data. You will see the consolidated data displayed on the chosen sheet. With links to the source data if selected, any changes made to the source data will automatically reflect in the consolidated output. You can further format the output data as needed. If I press ALT plus O plus A, automate format window open. Choose desired style and press OK. Once consolidated, you can expand or collapse the data to view it department wise or month wise. If you expand data department wise, you can change same department like this. If you click on this option 2, all data expand. You can see here, if you select option 1, all data collapse. This functionality makes it easy to manage and analyze large sets of data efficiently using the consolidate function in Excel. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something new from this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the like button to support more informative content like this. Stay tuned for the next video. And until then, take care.